वेलकम बैक टू अनदर इन्फॉर्मेटिव वीडियो ऑन वॉल स्ट्रीट बेट्स रेडिट फोरम सो गाइज वॉट विल बी द नेक्स्ट गेम स्टॉक अ वेरी बिग क्वेश्चन राइट इज देर एनी वे टू फाइंड द नेक्स्ट बूमिंग स्टॉक्स कैन वी डू सम वेब स्क्रैपिंग ऑफ वॉल स्ट्रीट बेट्स रेडिट फोरम टू फाइंड द टेन नेक्स्ट हॉट स्टॉक्स इन द मार्केट Yes, we can. Hello, everyone. I'm Ritwik Dashora, and I'm back with a new video and some new learnings. In this video, we'll talk about the next ten hot stocks that are being discussed the most on the most famous uh, Reddit forum, which is Wall Street Bets. And no one knows. One of them can be the next game stop. Disclaimer: This is not my investment advice. I'm just teaching you how to find the ten most discussed stocks in the market. Similar to my last video, we will extract uh, information from this forum, and uh, then we'll do some analysis on Python, and then eventually we'll come up with a result. Also, if you want to watch my last video, you can click on this I button. I have mentioned a lot of things in that video as well. Also, watch this video till the end, and there's a wonderful gift for all my subscribers. The strategy behind this analysis is that we will uh, extract all these titles, which are threads, and uh, the comments inside them of the top section because the top represents um, the threads which are being discussed the most. Uh, the threads which have the most upvotes and comments, and then uh, after that, what we'll be doing is we will find. It, information that what are the in, what are the stocks that are being discussed the most in both the thread titles and all the comments so let's start writing the code i'll start uh, with importing the libraries that i used in my last video as well which are pro p r a w and r e which represents regular expressions um if you want to know how to synchronize pro with python then watch my last video i have explained a uh, step by step procedure how to extra, how to synchronize pro api so that you can extract information from reddit directly so let me start with importing pro and re import pro import re i will also import um i would say pandas here import pandas spd now let's use pro library to extract the information reddit is equal to so what i've done here is uh, reddit is equal to pro dot reddit and then all this information i explained each and everything in my last video and then subreddit is equal to reddit dot subreddit and then wall street bets because we are interested in wall street bets forum now before extracting the information about the most discussed stocks uh, we'll have to see what are all what is the list of all traded stocks in uh, exchange like nasdaq i have posted a link in the description box just click on that and this will download uh, a text file and it will look like this which has a list of all the stocks that are traded in nasdaq and you can see that it starts with the ticker this it's like y and then the straight line then ticker and then all the information about that company like the company name and the etc etc so what i'm interested is into the all these ticker symbols right so what we'll have to do some work here in order to extract just these stickers i'm not interested in these uh, description and also this y so let's do it um with open nasdaq traded dot text as f lines is equal to f dot read lines and then this so let me see lines as uh, if i run lines then i can see that all the uh, like everything is in python right now and actually i'm not interested in the first line so what i can do is like this so let me just name it like companies is equal to line one and if i run companies again i should get all these things now as i mentioned i'm just interested in the tickers so what i can do is let me just write companies and then one so i'm just interested in this and not at, not at all interested in this so if i do it like this do this yeah, this is how i can eliminate this y and that that straight line in order to eliminate all these things i'll have to use find function so it it will be like companies one dot find what to find is yes, comma easy so we can get the tickers like this i just need a very small for loop here in order to get a list of all the tickers or i would say a dictionary of all the tickers so let's make a dictionary for that so let me just write all tickers is equal to an empty dictionary and then similarly let me just write that let me just uh, introduce this hot tickers as well because this will be the end uh, dictionary that we'll be referring to in order to get the hot stocks <laughs> which is our goal four lines line in companies ticker is equal to line two colon line dot find and then this from two so now let me just put everything in all tickers so all tickers ticker is equal to just let, let me just provide a number like one in the end after running this if i run all tickers let me see so yeah i've got a list of all the tickers in that 
file in the text file and with a value of one in the end now similar to my last video we'll have to find the tickers so it will be regex regex pattern is equal to this um, uh, and i have already explained uh, what does this mean so let me just run it like this so let's go step by step uh, to extract thread titles and the comments of that reddit forum um, so we have subreddit here let me just do it like this for submission in subreddit dot top and then day i'm considering daily uh, threads here because uh, uh, one thing with the very sensitive market it's uh, very good if we just consider the daily uh, uh, comments and daily threads and second thing is that it can crash if i increase uh, the number of days like it, if i make it weekly or monthly it can crash my uh, my program because you can see that all these uh, threads have a lot of comments inside them so it can make this file very heavy so if i print submission dot title and if i break it it will it should give me the first th uh, thread of that forum perfect so the first title is week about weed about to make me a millionaire in 2021 this is the first uh, title i let me just recheck it. yeah weed about to make a, me a millionaire in 2021 and he's talking about investing not consuming very bad perfect so uh, let me just change it to strings is equal to submission dot title now let me um, get the comments of this particular thread for for comment in submission dot comments dot list actually i should uh, write uh, this line is very important because it will give me all the comments uh, okay come back to this for loop let me just print the first comment so print comment dot body and then let me break this as well okay so uh, we have got the first title and first comment as well actually the first title actually i removed that print it was weed something weed about to make me a millionaire 2021 and the first comment is how you how, how do you make all that money buying weed or investing in that so yeah he's a funny guy jokes apart we'll have to append all the comments into a uh, uh, with the title with the main title such that we have a list of the title and all the comments uh, but before that i'll have to make this into a list and then let me just append everything in strings strings dot append comment dot body let me just run this code and if i run strings here yeah i have got a list of the uh, the, the the title and the first comment now what I need to do here is uh, append all the column, uh, all the comments and the title. So let me just remove this break for now and run this code again. Yeah. So we have got the title and very good words and the comments, right? <laughs> uh, now the next task would be not to just focus on the first uh, uh, thread. We are interested in all the threads, right, of this page. So I'll have to break this as well. But before that, uh, what I'll have to do is I'll have to find all the relevant tick tickers or i would say symbols or stocks that are being discussed in this particular um, list and then we'll just replicate the same for all the threads that is available so let's do it for s and strings for phrase and re dot find all regex pattern dot s and then this regex pattern by, by writing this i i mean that all the words that are mentioned in capital letters are the words that i'm looking forward because um, usually what we do is we present uh, any particular ticker in capital letters like for game stock it's, it's gme for apple it's aapl for microsoft it's msft in capital letters so these are this represents the capital letters will i'll be looking for all uppercase uh, words but i'm not interested if someone has written by for example b y b u y in capital letter i'm not interested in that i'm just interested in all the uh, uppercase words which are actually tickers and that's why i have uh, got a list of all the tickers which are relevant in this case so i'll have to check whether all these uh, phrases are in those uh, are in the list of that uh, all tickers list and then we'll, we'll have to see that um, like we'll have to make another dictionary which is hot tickers to get to know about the number of times it has been that particular ticker has been dis discussed so if phrase in all tickers then only we'll have to see that whether we have already put that ticker in hot tickers uh, dictionary so if phrase not in 
hot tickers let's just add one more segment in that dictionary so hot tickers phrase is equal to one put a value give a, give a value of one there else hot tickers phrase plus is equal to one so if it's already there it will increase the value of that particular ticker by one let me run this code and let's see what happens now we'll have to uh, run hot tickers and let's see <clears throat> so yeah i have got all these tickers that are being discussed d l r y is a ticker which is disc which has been discussed 46 times and then a f a p h a 55 times i m o a m c etc so these are the hot topics for the first thread now what i'll have to do is i'll have to remove this and then run this code which will take a lot of time i'll have to pause this video for a moment and then i'll come back to you after running this code bingo it took me around five minutes to run this code it's quite heavy code but uh, yeah let's see let's run this cell now yeah this is the list of this is the dictionary of all the tickers and the number of times it is uh, discussed but we'll have to sort it in order to get to the final result so series is equal to pd dot series and then hot tickers dot sort values ascending is equal to false let me just run series perfect we have got this and then if i do it like this i'll get the 10 most hottest uh, stocks that are being discussed the most gme for sure it is uh, the one of the most hottest topic let's see the share price of apha so let me just write apha share price it's 24.54 percent up last day let's uh, try tlry share price tlry share price it is also 40.74 percent uh, sndl share price sndl share price it is also 28.91 percent up last day we can see that we have created something great here right so what can be the uh, trading strategy that we can implement to monetize this opportunity if you have something in your mind please mention in the comment box i have a couple of strategies uh, in my mind uh, i'll be sharing my thoughts on patreons if you want to know my opinion and how to uh, make algorithm how to uh, monetize these types of uh, opportunities then please consider becoming a patreon member on patreon you can reap infinite benefits there i post uh, numerous exclusive posts such as uh, tip of the day uh, premium fintech posts uh, access to full unedited podcast videos and all my research material other benefits include talking to me directly by chatting after becoming a member of uh, the premium whatsapp group uh, monthly google hangout and one-on-one -on -one skype calls and many more so don't think twice just join this community of royal people the patreon link is in the description box now this particular code will be uh, made freely available to all my subscribers and uh, as all my subscribers already know that i share my google drive with everyone and i hope that all my codes and all my uh, study materials are helping you a lot uh, my new viewers you can get a free access of my google drive by subscribing and then clicking on the access to my google drive button and then just providing some basic details and i'll be using that email address that you mentioned to provide a free access of my google drive to my subscribers if you like my work you can also support me by buying me a coffee a big shout out to mr edmund dantes on becoming patreon member uh, and also thank you so much fahim natrajan part time larry and siyadat swapnil for buying me a coffee and my recent subscribers are down below if you found this video informative then please please like this video it really helps with the algorithm and also share it with your friends it will definitely be one of one of their favorites video uh, you can click here uh, to subscribe to my YouTube channel and uh, also there are some recommended videos on that side. Thank you so much. Um, see you in the next video.